what's unusual about Apogee is that most of the time when you see a golf facility this big with this many golf courses, it's either a resort or it's, some, it's tied to housing in, in a development. When we started looking five years ago for a piece of property, this one we determined, and we looked in North Palm Beach County, Southern Martin County, and you know, they're, they're limited tracks big enough to do a project like this with this many golf courses. What appealed to us about this golf course were not only the big native trees and vegetation, but also it's very sandy. Every golf course in the world is better if it's built on sand. It drains better, the golf course bounces. Another big attraction was right on the St. Lucie Canal, and we, that's where we get our water. So instead of extracting it from wells where you get a lot of minerals and things that aren't necessarily good for golf courses, um, we're pulling water out of the St. Lucie. It's water that's fresh, that it's got nutrients from farming, and it's a great environmental story for this area because as this nutrient-rich water heads towards the Atlantic, it hits brackish water, creates an algae bloom. So environmentally, every drop of water we take off, and essentially we're water farming. We're, we, we've got almost It'll be about 170 acres of lakes when we're all done. It's a way to cleanse the water. We're putting nutrients on our golf course that we're not otherwise having to use, so it's a great story. Well, listen, if you, if you look from a macro standpoint, golf is growing internationally. It's growing in the United States. It's growing in Florida. It's growing in Southeast Florida and these counties. Um, there are more golfers in the United States than we've ever had. There are more women playing than ever. There's more junior golfers, more girls playing. There's more rounds being played. People are moving to Florida. So even five years, before, five years ago, before COVID struck, we knew this was one of these special markets. It's no coincidence. There's just, people love the game of golf. They, and they're moving here, and there just frankly wasn't enough golf. Both club, you know, private golf, as well as is public access. There is enough demand with all the building that's actually on the docket. There's enough demand here in Palm Beach County and, and Martin County to, uh, to, to fill all these golf courses, we believe. Where there's really a shift now to how do we make the experience welcoming for all golfers? How do we make it fun for all golfers? I look at it holistically saying it's, it's been a rocky, turbulent couple years it will absolutely figure itself out. The game of golf is way bigger than just the men's elite professional game. Although we know the men's elite professional game, it inspires people to play. So, you know, I, I, I think the game is in a really good place. I think the game has also learned from its past mistakes. And, uh, you know, we're, we're seeing just great numbers across, across the country right now.